Okay, so we're doing uh we're doing something different today. I just got a message from a good friend of mine. He's a colleague about some Amazon scammers that we were dealing with last night. Looks like they're back. Uh, yesterday, last night, I should say, we managed to get them to ditch. I think it was either three or four different phone numbers. All of them were on problematic carriers, so there was nothing we could do there except call them back until they until they got tired of us. Um, it got so bad that they actually ditched their website, so it looks like they're back with a different phone number and a different website right now. So let's see how long it takes for them to get rid of this phone number or to get rid of this website. Um, I'm going to do things differently today. Yesterday, I just called them up and played them music. This time, I'm going to call them up and waste their time while playing music on the second line. So let's let's see how much they can take. I just checked the time earlier, and it's about seven seven o one in the morning in India. So they've just broke they've just broken night, and they must be extremely tired. So let's see how they deal with this new uh this new technique. Hello? Thank you for calling. How can I help you? Yes, sir. Hi. Uh, I was wondering if I could get some assistance here with my TV code, sir. Um, I'm just on your website okay, here right can... now, and I'm not able to activate the code. It just says to call you guys back for, uh, I think it says the uh, phone verification services. I'm not sure. Uh, so I was wondering if it was possible Tell to activate the, the code, code on the, uh, over the phone, um, if it's yeah, possible. I'm again. Tell me what is the code? Uh, yes, sir. My zip code is a uh, one one two one five. This is the, uh, the same code, zip on code TV I have screen, on, the, uh, on the Amazon account. Sir, I'm in the, the code on a TV here, screen. By the way, I don't know if that's yes, sir. What is the code on a TV screen? Yes, sir. Yes, yes. Of course. I'm sorry. It's uh the letters WCW followed by the number seven one eight. Can you help me with the and first name? I tried last typing name? in the uh the code into your website a couple of times and it just didn't seem to work for some reason. Um, Help me I tried it on the, uh, name, both on my cell phone and I tried it on the computer and I'm still getting the same problem. Uh, Help so me with the first I, and last uh, expired name. The code. Yes, sir. Help me with the first and last name, sir. Yes, sir. It's um, WCW718 for the TV code, just in case you didn't hear Your first, first time. and last name. I'm not sir, sure why the uh, code hasn't. Yes, sir. Tell me your name. Yes, it's WCW, sir, and then the number 718. I don't know what else to do. Maybe talk to a real person instead of trying to do the uh, the automation here. I don't know. Hello? Uh, yes, sir? What is your name? Yes, sir. In case you didn't hear me the first time, the uh, code is WCW718, sir. Do you know what I'm speaking? Do you know what I'm talking to? There's a lot of voice you? in the background, sir. I'm sorry if you can't hear me there. I don't know what the, uh, uh, what the issue is here, but uh, go ahead. What is your name? Yes. What is your name? Do you know what's your name? Yes, the, the code Wait, is WCW718, sir. Uh, once again, if there's uh, too much noise in the background, sorry, I apologize. I don't know. I guess you guys are busy uh, because of the holiday season. Um, so I'm sorry if you can't hear me correctly. Thank you for staying connected. Your call has been transferred to me. How can I help you? I was transferred? Yes. Oh. What was wrong with the uh, previous gentleman before? I was uh, talking to somebody else, I think. He was not. I he was, was not able to, to fuck the, uh, you. I so hard. Your seven generations will remember. Uh, inconvenience here. I'm sorry, sir. I didn't. You're just a rotten neck from the, a rotten uh, vagina. I can hear the technician in the background. He sounds upset, sir. I'm sorry. Was there something that uh, I was not providing? I can hear him screaming in the background. Can sir. you hear I was me? Just trying to get the. Yes, sir. I will fuck you so hard. Your seven generations yes, will sir, remember. You're just a rotten neck from a rotten vagina. But I also hear the gentleman in the background here. He sounds upset. I'm sorry. I don't know. Nobody scares us. What the problem is here, sir? <laughs> All right, so that's two angry scammers. <laughs> Let's keep it going. You know, some people have asked me, um, how is it that I'm able to stay, uh, to stay in character and just talk over them when they're cursing at me like that? Well, the real answer is, um, I kind of have to because they, when they start swearing at you, it's because they've already known they've been defeated. So. They want to get a reaction from you. They want you to be pissed off. They want you to get angry and curse at them back so that they can just ignore it and laugh at you for cursing back at them. I'm not one of those guys that's blessed to cut 25-minute angry promos on scammers that makes them feel so defeated that they just hang up the calls. I can't do that. Other scam baiters can do that, and they're more effective by doing it. That's their style. I can't do that. Like I've tried many times, but I've always felt like it was just a waste of my own time. And the scammer ended up you know, feeling... The way he wanted to feel which is why he started cursing me out which was he wanted to feel like he won they're petty 
they're absolutely petty. They're children. So when you just talk over them and you don't pay attention to them, it pisses them off so much that they just rage quit. Thank you for calling. Uh, sí, you. señores. Ese señor Rigo Tobar y su costa azul llamando de nuevo. Uh, what, 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 what? Si es what? posible activar mi código aquí de mi televisión de Amazon. Speak in English. Speak in English. Okay. Sí, señor. Speak in English. Uh, sí, señor. Como te estaba diciendo, Speak in no English. quiero saber si puedo activar mi este código de mi televisión aquí. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, if you hear me typing, that's me chatting with my my friend and uh, inputting the commands for the the second line. Thank you for calling. Uh, sí, señor, ese es el señor Rico Tobar y su costa azul llamando de nuevo. Uh, yo nada más quiero saber si me puedes What ayudar con mi código de Amazon, por favor. Lo que pasa es que aquí dice que necesito llamar What este is... número para que me activen el código de mi televisión. Ah, uh, y no sé si este se si expiró el código o si necesito uno nuevo, señor. So, nomás quiero saber si me puedes ayudar porque no ya tengo más de más de 10 minutos, creo, que estoy tratando de activar bye este bye. código y no Sí, señor. Bueno. <laughs> you know, it's funny how um I've been seeing so many scammers use Spanish names, but when they hear the Spanish language, they get so pissed off. You know, if it was up to me, I would speak to them in Spanish all the time. But uh, my audience, I think, is primarily English speaking, so I, I can't do it. Thank you for calling Prime. Ah, David, sí, señor. Es el señor Rigo Tobar y su costa azul llamando de nuevo. Uh, parece que se cortó la llamada. <laughs> it always makes me laugh how fast they run away from Spanish. <laughs> They've ditched it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Done. Those noises you hear is the, is the calls uh, dropping because the, <laughs> the phone's been disconnected. <laughs> gotta let my friend know. Ah, uh, all right. Uh, so there you go, guys. That's uh, well, that's one way to get rid of a phone number. Um, I'm not one to keep them. I'm not one to allow a phone number to be up for an extended period of time. The first phone number I find, it automatically gets reported. So, and uh, I just got a message from my my friend here, and their website has been taken offline <laughs> because of the constant calls. Again, uh, I apologize for the quality of the video. I'll, I'll do my best to, to find some sort of software that records my screen so it'll at least give you guys something to watch other than just a Pokemon card. Enjoy your your weekend. Enjoy your uh, holidays, even though they passed. But I hope you had good ones and take care. See you guys later.